We got Wheezy here, just like the uh, penguin from Toy Story. Welcome in everybody. We're back with another evolution video. We're going back to Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl to do another starter evolution. Um, we recently did Totodile, we did Cyndaquil, and Pokemon Legends Arceus. But now we're going back to Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl to do Chikorita, the last of the Gen 2 starters. So as we take a look here, we have our Chikorita. And again, we are in the underground. Um, I'm over a little fire biome here. Because with Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl, as we said before, we kind of have to go about it the old-fashioned way. Um, a lot of battling to get the XP and not just, hey, here's candies, take it. So we'll do a couple quick battles here, get our Chikorita evolved, and we will figure it out. We're going to fight this Macargo. Um, and again, with this Empoleon, this should be really easy to kind of you know, mow through these Pokemon here. Because uh, at least it is just an easy level evolution. Chikorita went from 6 to 20. Um, it kind of shot past what we needed, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. Um, so to evolve Chikorita, it's going to learn a bunch of moves because it was level 5 or 6 or whatever. But again, not worried about the moves. I'm just here to evolve the Pokemon. Magical Leaf I would normally do, but again, we're just here to evolve. Chikorita evolves into Bayleaf at level 16. So there you have it. Our Chikorita has evolved into Bayleaf. Bayleaf's data was added to the Pokedex. The Leaf Pokemon. A spicy aroma from the buds around its neck. Bayleaf was always one of my favorite Pokemon that Ash had just because it was just so friendly. Um, but now let's work on evolving Bayleaf into Meganium. I really like all of Gen 2's starters. Um, I, as I said previously, went with Totodile just because I was a strictly water starter kind of person. Um, but we're gonna quickly knock out this camera up. This seems to be going much quicker than our Totodile evolution did. Much more XP as it's level 23. We do have a little bit of ways to go before it evolves. So. Again, fire biome shouldn't take us long. Some pretty quick knockouts. We're gonna slowly work through the remaining starter evolutions that we've not done. Uh, the great part about Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl, they're pretty much true remakes. And back then we had access to the entire national decks. So all of the first four generation of Pokemon are available. So we will be going through all of the starters from the first four generations that I've not done videos for in the past. And we'll work our way through Gen 2 right now. So I would rather not fight the Skorupis, not that it's difficult, but they're not going to give as much XP because they're not evolutions. The evolved Pokemon give us more XP. There should be a door down here, there it is. I knew there had to be somewhere down there to reset. And now what do you have for us? Nummel, not an evolution. My cargo gave a lot of XP the first time. Definitely looking for those evolutions for a bigger chunk of XP. We got Wheezy here, just like the uh, penguin from Toy Story. Because whenever I was playing through Blaine Diamond and Shining Pearl, that was the first thing that I thought of. A little Wheezy from Toy Story that was left up on the shelf. Level 27, getting closer. It's down to about two levels per knockout. It's going to be down to one, and then this might take a little bit. Onyx, not an evolution. Skaroopy, not an evolution. Reset one more time and see if we get any evolutions. 
make sure you're subscribed because I will be doing evolutions for the starters in Scarlet and Violet as soon as possible. Um, expect those very soon on in the process. We're just going to fight some of these because we need the experience coming. It's not going to reset, reset, reset until we get evolutions. Some evolved forms of them. Also, right now, I don't have any fire types here. So that's cool. Use drill pick. And it didn't one-shot it. All right. Good to know. Yeah, so we're not going to fight any more of the Skarupis because we don't one-shot it with drill pick. I'm a little surprised, but... We're level 77 and it was... I think 60. So we're gonna look for fire types. We're here for the fire types. Centret is not a fire type. What is happening? There's a Houndoom, but Centret's like a Route 2 Pokemon. Why is it in here? I don't need this. It's not gonna be much XP either. And I don't have anything super effective. I mean, Surf's still one-shots, but not super effective. 780. It got us up the rest of that one level. There we go. Houndoom and Camera Up. That's more like it. That's what we're looking for. I think that was one of the better parts about the Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl remakes is they did change the underground, so you had these biomes. You were able to get some different type Pokemon pretty early on in the game that normally you would not be able to. So you need a fire type? Hey, just go to the underground, find yourself a fire type. There we go, 3,500 almost. Still need a few levels, but that's quicker. I think another 35 might push us up two, but we'll see. Come on, surf. Nice and easy. Down goes camera. 31. Yeah, see, 35 would have pushed us up too. But we only got 31. So we have a level 30 Bayleaf right now. Hey, Graveler's an evolution. McCargo's an evolution. We'll see just how close we can get here. Because it is in the low 30s, so we're getting close. So we will use Surf. Oh, it's got sturdy. It's got sturdy. Even hit a crit. Yep, there's sturdy. Oh, recoil will knock it out. That, that, that works too. Thanks for helping us out, Graveler. Saving me to just one attack. Good. 23 100 we're level 31 so this mccargo should push us over all we need is level 32 there we go mccargo there's wheezy and surf and that should be all we need to evolve Bayleaf into Meganium. Yep. Plenty. We probably could have knocked out this groupie and got it. Um, sweet Scent. Again, not worried about the moves. We're just here for this little evolution right here. Level 32, Bayleaf into Meganium. So there you have it. Our Bayleaf has evolved into Meganium. Meganium is being added to the Pokedex. Again, I'm evolving shiny Pokemon just because I moved it over from Pokemon Go, and I could. Um, Petal Dance, again, normally would, but not worried about it. And get away from the Skaroopy real quick, and we're gonna take a closer look at Meganium. As level 32, there it is. 
Bayleaf evolves into Meganium. Again, I moved it from Pokemon Go. It has a little Go marker. I do hope you guys are enjoying the evolution videos. I'm trying to do my best to provide some basic information that maybe not everybody knows. Um, I know some people have levels memorized. And, of course, newer Pokemon, you're not going to know right away. So, hope you guys are finding these helpful. Be sure to like if you're enjoying them. Subscribe if you're new. We have lots more evolutions to cover. And as I said before, Scarlet and Violet, not far away. We'll be doing evolutions with those new Pokemon as well. So, make sure you're subscribed. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.